Hello and good morning. Happy Valentine's Day. I would like to start today by making one thing very, very clear. Each and every one of you is my Valentine's today, and I'm sending so many hearts and hugs your way. I think that it is so, so neat that we have Sunday school on Valentine's Day, because on Valentine's Day, we celebrate love. Love for our friends, our family, ourselves, that special someone. One never-ending source of love is God. Even if it's not Valentine's Day, God loves you and is so excited about it. We get to learn more about the love of God today, and I think that is a great way to start our Valentine's Day together. Our Bible story today is about Jesus and his friends on a boat. When they were in the middle of the sea, a storm blew up and it scared all of the friends. The wind was blowing and howling. Waves were crashing against the side of the boat. People were being tossed around and somebody probably got a little seasick. Look at this picture of Jesus and his friends on the boat. They are packed in there. Look at that. That looks kind of scary to me. But Jesus told his friends not to worry. God was faithful and always with them. And Jesus was guiding his friends to not be afraid because God was with them. Let's watch a story to let's watch a video together. I guess it's kind of a story to learn more about this. I got rid of it. No, I didn't. Greetings, I'm Samuel. In today's story, Jesus is in a boat with his disciples. After a long day of teaching, Jesus is tired and is ready to cross the lake. When he gets in the boat, Jesus falls asleep. While he's sleeping, a storm comes and rocks the boat back and forth. The disciples get really scared. I would be too. They wake up Jesus and ask him how he can sleep when the boat is rocking so hard. Jesus tells the wind to calm down and the waters became calm again. Whoa, the disciples are amazed. After Jesus calms the storm, he says to the disciples, why are you frightened? Don't you have faith yet? In this moment, Jesus reminds us, that our faith is not just important during good times. Jesus shows us to have faith when things are hard too. One time, the power went out in my house and I was in my room alone. And I was really scared because I don't like the dark. I left my room and went to find my parents. I always feel safe with them. And I knew I would feel better when I got to them. When I got to their room, they gave me a big hug and reminded me that I would be okay. They also gave me a flashlight, which made the dark not as scary. After they gave me the flashlight, they told me this story. My dad said the disciples were scared in their storm too. Jesus came and he calmed it. Jesus also reminded them to have faith, even when it's hard too. I was still a little scared, but the story gave me hope. My parents took out more flashlight so that we could make shadow animals on the wall with them. I realized everything was okay, even though it started off scary. Jesus shows us what to do in difficult times, in times of trouble. We can use Jesus as a guide. This can be hard when you're afraid and you don't know what to do. Remember, Jesus is with us in every situation. Whether you are feeling really good or having a really hard time. Even when it's hard, you can have faith. Now it's your turn to wonder. All right. Thank you for sitting with me and listening to that video. What I think is really silly about that video is the fact that Jesus was able to fall asleep on the boat. How sound of a sleeper is he? I wonder if he snored. But what I also love about that video is how Samuel, our friend from the video, made shadow animals on his wall to make him feel less afraid of the dark. It's okay to be scared of things. It's okay to be scared of the dark, but
but there are ways to calm ourselves down and feel less afraid. Samuel went to his parents and they helped him make shadow puppets. Next time you are scared, you can take deep breaths in through your nose, out through your mouth, and go to an adult that you trust. Maybe you and that adult can find something to do that makes the scary thing a little less scary. God loves us and he doesn't want us to be scared. Even when things are tough and you don't feel good, know that you are so loved and that there are people around you to help you find your way out of that scary situation. That's what God wants us to know, that even if we're in a boat on an ocean that's rocking back and forth and we might get seasick, that there is a way out and the boat will calm down eventually and that we will all be okay. So let's do a prayer together. Let's make some prayer hands and do some more listening. Again, you can repeat after me or you can just listen. Dear God, thank you for helping me feel safe even when I am stuck in a storm. Amen. And thank you so much, you guys, for listening to me and being here with me on this Sunday, on this Valentine's Day. I hope you get a chance to eat some candy and enjoy the rest of your day. It was so good to talk to you, and I will see you again next week.